Hi beautiful angels, welcome to my channel. I hope you are doing well, moving forward, making progress. <laughs> so I'm here today to find out what are the three major events are happening in the month of June. We will try to find out and I will use this deck today to pull three cards for three major events happening in the month of June. Right. And there is a one card over here. Spiritual union. Wow. And one more card, please. Three major events are happening. So these are many cards. I just need a uh, one card. Okay. So I got two more here. So we'll keep them. So it's a trust. And the last one is that is on the floor service. So, you can say that four major events happening. <laughs> so, let's find out. So, let's see what are the four major events happening in the month of June. First of all, with the service. I feel good when I can help others. So, I think your dedication to serve others will increase in the month of June. Okay, and you will become more sensitive, empathetic. You will feel that, oh, doesn't matter what I'm going through. Whatever, um, you know, circumstances are, chaotic situations are. But I am feeling strong urge to help others. Okay, that you cannot stop yourself. You will try to find the ways in any ways like you can help others. So that's definitely helping. You will provide the services. It could help uh, like it could be uh, doing volunteer somewhere or, um, you know, donating the things anyway. Or healing, inspiring, motivating, providing guidance. There are tons of tons of ways you can help others. Okay. All the living beings. So definitely. Uh, you will start doing something. It could be something new you're starting in the month of June. Okay, it could be like you could be the tarot reader or a healer that you start new channel in the month of June. So definitely that's, that is a happening. You will find out the ways and maybe the new beginning in the spiritual journey over here. Okay, that will definitely involve helping others. That will definitely involve providing services to others. Or maybe you are also receiving some kind of service that, that I can also feel that you may be getting the healing done or maybe the um, getting the reading done. Okay, and if you need a personal reading from me, you can contact me. Uh, my email address is given in the description box. So please do contact me. So let's see what is the next second uh, big event is happening. You're trusting your inner voice. You're trusting your intuition more and more. Okay. Whatever the ideas is being given to you, you know that it is the universe helping you to move forward, to grow spiritually. Okay, it's not only about the spiritually, it could be about your career, your personal growth. You will receive a lot of ideas and you, what you will do, you're listening. Maybe in the past, you were avoiding those ideas. You weren't trusting, uh, trusting your inner voice, whatever the messages were given to you. You, you wouldn't fully, uh, fully, um, you know, trusting them 100%, but now you're doing it. You're listening to your inner voice and you're ready to take the action and you definitely do that. And it could be also the new beginnings and um, our ideas are given to you about your creativity, about um, 
to start something okay or it could be the ideas for your personal growth it could be anything but you're trusting more that will help you to grow in all in all areas of your life okay because you're listening you're trusting more on these messages okay let's see what is the third big events is happening here with the spiritual union it's it's a more like it's more like you're coming into the union of yourself okay if it is not the partner it is like your masculine and feminine are coming together you're becoming more spiritually aligned okay so that's why you are receiving a lot of a uh, lot of intuitive messages here because when you are spiritually aligned your mind body soul your masculine feminine are aligned that's the only time you are so into the spiritual union with yourself or with the with the divine that you could easily communicate with the universe easily you don't have to work hard you don't have to you know try harder to connect with the uh, connect with the universe or divine here okay so you will be so inclined with the yeah, with the universe you could hear all the messages and that's also help you to heal heal lots of low vibration feelings emotions okay and and heart chakra obviously and this will also transform your life so i can see the butterfly over there so whenever this union is happening you will feel so balanced and harmony okay that is the point you will transforming your life you will also feel you will also realize that oh this is the point okay and if it is the person definitely spiritual union is happening it is a, a divinely guided uh, union that is happening it, you're connecting with your uh, masculine or feminine your twin flame soulmate any anyone that is uh, that is that is sent by the divine over here that is actual the um, divinely guided union is happening over here okay with your fam uh, with your divine feminine or with your with your divine masculine over here so enjoy that's really fulfill uh fulfilling your um fulfilling your heart your heart is healing when you coming together you're so in balance and harmony giving to each other that you will heal each other's heart you will be so dedicated so loving caring nurturing and so loyal in this relationship that you would heal each other wherever it needs healing it will heal when you come come into this union okay for fourth big event is happening that you are leaving the ego behind if if any kind of changes that you wanted to make but when you try your ego comes in and then that is the time you step back and couldn't move forward so this time you're not letting this happen i love myself and i see myself in everyone okay and you're not judging other people you're not judging yourself you're not uh, letting the ego stop you to doing the things or moving forward or letting it go releasing the things that uh, or the people or the relationship that is not uh, resonating or that is not um, helping you anymore you're not letting ego take the decision overtake you and uh, take the decision for you okay so there is a ego death is also happening over here that is letting you to move forward that letting you to grow that letting you to this spiritual union union happening that is letting you to trust more to your inner voice here okay that is letting you to move ahead don't worry about the people what they what will they say what are their opinions you will just do what is available for you to to help others 
okay so these are the four events are happening let's see the other messages with the sand reading so let's see what are the other messages for the month of june we'll receive all kind of messages over here okay so this is a journal collective reading so it's possible that only few messages resonate with you or couple of them or maybe the whole reading it depends okay but don't force this reading just keep what resonates okay and leave what doesn't okay let's move forward um we will start with the career over here what is happening at your career place we will try to find out and we will check the journal energies at career place you're make, making some changes okay upgrading or adding some skills okay and it could be new career path also you that you starting the most probably this career path is uh, related to your passion that you always wanted to follow and now is the time that you actually uh, will work with it okay that's what is happening you're making the making the making the changes at your place career place it could be upgrading your skill it could be adding new services or new products okay especially if you have your own work and also i can see the promotion some kind of promotion and raise is happening too for you in the month of june your work will be recognized okay whatever the work you do or whatever your specialty is will be recognized in the month of june people will ask for uh, help and guidance from you okay if you're working with the team or in the office the uh, very obviously the people are coming your colleagues are coming teammates are coming asking for your guidance and help because you have very unique ideas watch for the copycats so you might, might find, see that your ideas are being stolen people are copying your ideas okay so you have to look for that make sure that it's not happening okay if you are facing um, lots of challenges or uh, lots of challenges or problems at your workplace uh you're getting the balance back okay you're getting the balance harmony um at your workplace you can actually peacefully work wherever you work i don't know how uh it's possible maybe maybe uh maybe your boss is leaving for holidays okay it could be something something it could be something miraculous that i can hear miraculous is happening that you really want to be in peace or harmony at your workplace and it is finally happening okay i don't know uh, what is it about and how will it happen but it definitely uh, it is happening okay you will have more passion you're adding more passion you're adding more uh inspiration um at your workplace whatever you work on okay and that will help you to you know uh, to be successful uh and to receive the a uh, lot of appreciation for your work because you're putting so much effort you're putting so much interest and new ideas um you're just losing yourself working hard okay 
so that's why so how much you you focusing how much efforts you're putting in you will uh, reap the rewards in the month okay let's move on to your relationships as we have seen that spiritual union was there okay definitely who are single uh, will find their soulmate or uh, twin flame or coming into the union reunion but let's see uh, what else messages are available for your relationship here relationship area your relationship with yourself is getting better and better you're feeling more confident you're feeling so comfortable you're feeling stable in mentally emotionally spiritually okay you're allowing yourself to flow you're not you're not um restricting yourself you're not limiting yourself oh i have to just do this 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 no you're you're taking your time you're not forcing yourself into the relationship or doing the stuff okay for yourself too you just in the flow you're coming down you're in the harmony you're enjoying the present moment not not um, you know not thinking about the past and not being anxious about uh, about the future you're just enjoying the present moment you are in the flow okay and you will bring the balance and harmony and healing uh, in your relationship okay and you're not you uh, the you know what what is the reason because you're becoming independent emotionally mentally you're not uh, your happiness doesn't doesn't depend on other people now you're you're taking the responsibility of your happiness your stability any every kind of stability mentally emotionally spiritually financially that is the reason you're feeling so uh, calm you're feeling so in tuned you're feeling so mind body soul alignment that is the reason i told you in the spiritual union i could feel that um that you are becoming balanced and your masculine and feminine energies are becoming uh, are coming into the union okay so you you in the relationship area your relationship with yourself with the divine is improving is increasing in coming into so alignment that other relationship will automatically remove automatically improve okay and i said remove maybe some relationships or people have to be uh, removed from your life and they they being removed okay in this month okay they shouldn't they don't belong now uh, with your energy and i think divine is helping you by removing them from your life okay because they are not helping they're not helping anyway the cycle is finished end of the cycle okay let's see what is happening in spirituality you're trying in spirituality you're trying uh, so many different practices you are risking yourself uh, trying you know i'm not going to say risk i shouldn't be saying the risk it's just like experimenting different uh, different meditations different spiritual practices going um, you know out of comfort zone uh, going to the different places and finding the uh, finding peace okay finding a meditation place okay so you are again again you're so in tune with yourself that you can easily figuring it out easily um finding that a peaceful space inside of you and that is helping you to create the peace out out of you okay outside of you okay so definitely you're growing spiritually because you're ready to take the chance you're ready to experiment the different spiritual practices you are you're managing your time well okay so that's why you're making some time you're taking some times for your prayers you're not just finishing the work um, finishing the spiritual practices like oh i have to do this i have to do this you're taking time you're actually spending 
mindfully. Okay, if you have a 20 minutes, you're going to be just calmly use that 20 minutes so, uh, so perfectly that will help you do the whole day. So definitely spiritually, you are understanding a lot of stuff. You are trying new things. You are growing definitely and you know how to do the things. You are listening your inner voice. You are taking the action. Um, you know, if... Um, if your inner wise is asking you to take this decision or read this book or join this workshop, you are actually listening. You are actually doing it. That is helping you to grow spiritually. So you're aligned. Okay, let's see what is happening. Um, what is happening financially? Stability is coming into your finances. So, so if you were seeing your graph is going up, down, up, down, not a stable um, money into your life, but it is coming stable. You will see that um, constant pace is happening, is coming into your life. Constant change is uh, coming, okay? And you will see the con consistent amount is coming into your life. You're applying the new ideas. It's like uh, uh, right now, you uh, if you were thinking too much about lag, too much about the money, oh, it's not happening, when it's going to happen, you're actually letting it go, that idea, that stress, Okay, you're not overthinking about it. You're just, okay, what can I do to improve my abundance, to more improve my finances? So your focus will be more on solutions, on working on the new ideas, on working on listening to inner voice. Your focus is on removing the blockages. Your focus will be on receiving, how to receive the abundance, Okay. So you're doing all the positive steps, all the positive things into your life that will definitely start improving your finances in this month, okay? Let's see what is happening in your personal space, personal growth, what you're doing. You've actually learned how to prioritize yourself. That is the most important step. Beside all the chaos, beside all the uh, busyness of life, you are still taking time to love yourself, to take care of yourself. You nurture yourself. You're not blaming, oh, you didn't do that. You didn't do that for me. Um, you, We didn't go outside. We didn't go to the trip or we didn't go to the restaurant. You're not blaming anybody here. You're just doing what makes you happy plus prioritizing yourself your health your career that is also bringing so much of balance and harmony into your life and that is also helping you to grow all feel, all areas of your life that's so beautiful you are applying the new ideas at the same time you're learning to focus on the solutions you're learning to read the book, new books, to try new information, okay, to get the more information. All you're doing is the right things that you're supposed to do for your self-growth here, okay? So let's see the guidance for this month, for the month of June, the guidance. Okay, so here is the uh, first guidance. Let go of the idea of being right always. So what does it mean that you don't have to, if you're taking some decision, if you want to do something, you don't have to explain everyone. You, it, everyone shouldn't be angry what you're trying to do or with your decision. Let it be. Do what you want to do, what your intuition is guiding you. Okay, just do Go with that. You don't have to tell everyone why you're doing that. 
why you choose that why you taking this decision how you moving forward you don't have to explain and don't do it okay let's see what else the guidance here I don't know, um, you can let me know in the comment section. Don't uh, stop talking to everyone. You know that some people, what are their nature, okay, how much uh, positive they are thinking about you or how encouraging they are. Uh, you know that, each and every one, okay, because your intuition is also um, guiding you. And also, your intuition is also showing the red flags to you, okay? So you don't have to uh, talk with everyone. Just cut off, cut the cords, okay? You'll be happy that you did. Keep the small group of people that actually genuine, that actually... Uh, encourage you they actually are happy what you are or what you're doing okay just keep your i think most of you are doing this month but if not you should be doing that keep the circle small okay and let's see what is the final final message Beautiful life waiting for you, okay? Don't, uh, don't waste your time and energy, okay? Thinking about the past or about the future or spending time with the people that, that are not happy, okay? Or maybe draining you or not good for your energy, okay? So stop doing that. Just take the action what you can improve, where you, how you can improve your life how you bring the balance or harmony, how to improve in your career place or your uh, finances or connect with your abundance. Just work with those ideas and just enjoy your life, okay? So that was your sand reading and let's see what are the other messages. So now we will pull some cards from this deck, final messages for the for the month of June. Finances are improving. So money is definitely coming into your account. Get ready and pay gratitude. So that is definitely happening that I also got the messages. So a few more cards. Okay. I got enough. Bring back bring balance into your life connect to heart energy that was a spiritual union that's what you are doing actually bringing the balance or harmony into your life and peace into your life you're choosing you're doing mindfully all the things all the stuff amazing messages are coming from divine means the inner voice is telling you each and everything here a lot of messages you're receiving from the universe that is helping you to move forward send healing or blessing to someone or you already doing that uh, create a good karma okay send healing a blessing uh, to other people don't take others opinion so seriously you know yourself more than others do believe in yourself okay that's what you have to do you have to come out of the pride don't let's just you know keep thinking what he said she said don't pay attention you know yourself better than anybody else okay Please protect yourself with the Archangel Michael. So protection symbol is like that, making kind of shield, okay? So you can also um, use this symbol to protect your aura. Use it in all the four directions, okay? Take one step at a time. You can do it. Trust in the process, okay? Whatever you've been asked or receiving the messages or ideas, 
you can start working on that just take one baby step at a time okay get the help from pro uh, if you need any help that you think that oh i cannot do i don't know how to do it then get the help okay uh trust trust on divine okay definitely um everything will be okay everything will be fine so this is the reading for the month of june thank you thank you thank you so much for watching please like share and subscribe to my channel for more amazing videos thank you thank you thank you so much and bye for now.